shame, by truth not to be first, to know each thing composed in prose or verse. But do not fear, my heart for you commits to set up an academy of wits. I promise there won't be the slightest scrap of verse in Paris which won't find your lap. In fact, myself, I dabble here and there. When I'm in the mood to trifle or to dare, there are 200 songs of my composure. Next to my sonnets gaining broad exposure, a thousand epigrams and madrigals, not counting prose caricatures and riddles. Caricatures are never really quite as simple to compose as someone might suppose, but I will show you some of mine, which you may find quite deep in their design. Is it the riddles that you find most charming? Ah, those can be complex and quite disarming. But madrigals are what I'm famous for. Why, even now I'm working on a score for madrigal of history of Rome. In my heart, that work will have its home. You'll have a copy once I've had it printed. I promise you, as soon as it's been minted, I'll send you one bound in the finest leather. You see, I have to throw these things together to please the booksellers who get upset when they can't sell the latest thing to get. But I'm the self of an improvisation, which I made up upon an inspiration just yesterday while visiting a duchess who loves this sort of writing in so much as I wrote it for her right there on the spot. Improvisations are the breath of thought. Do listen while I work through this convention. I beg you give me your most rapt attention. Oh, oh! <laughs> I contemplated here, completely off my guard, with nothing else about or near, it quickly hit me. Far. Your eye, so sly, I did espy. With speed beyond belief, you stole my heart, and now I cry, Stop thief! Stop thief! Stop thief! Did you hear how I started it? Oh, oh. Catch a thief who runs a faster pace. As though the 
man had stolen of his chief possession, thus, Stop thief! <laughs> Oh. 